for then, for then, for then, for then must he offer often have suffered since the foundation of the world. Yep. But now, once in the end, yeah, of once the, in the end, right? of the world has he appeared to put away sin by the sacrifice of him. Yes, yeah, sacrifice of, his, himself. of himself. He did it one time for you, man. He's not going to go back on the cross again for you because you're not ready to be in this truth, man. He ain't going to do that again, man. He did it one time, man. Once was enough. And when he was on the cross, he told the Lord, said, Lord, why have that forsaken me, man? Why have that forsaken me? That cup was too much for him to bear, man. But he did it anyway because he loved the elect. He loved the elect, man. He didn't die for everybody. He only died for the elect, the chosen men. Yeah, that's right. We can Lord, huh? Right. So Christ was once offered to bear the sins of many. Yep. And unto them that took for him shall he appear the yep. second time without sin unto salvation. Yep. Yep, he did it once. Once to die in verse 27. Once. Once. This this right here, man, it's a narrow road, man. You find that scripture I think somewhere on a narrow road, son? Give me that scripture. Yeah, this is this is the straight gate. Give me, give me, give me something like that. Alright? A lot of men is afraid to come to this truth, man. Because really and truly, they don't really love the Lord, man. They say they love the Lord with their mouth. But when it's time to sacrifice your body as a living sacrifice, you don't want to do it. But the Savior did it for you. You can't do it for him. Come here, come out here once a week. Have class once a week. You can't do that. That's so hard. That's so hard for you to do. What, so what you got? Matthew right, chapter 13. No, no. And see you enter the straight gate. Why does the gate? I said what? Why does the gate? Matthew what? 7.13. Yep. And see you enter the straight gate. It said, enter ye the straight gate. For wide is the gate. For wide is the gate. And broad is the way. Yeah, broad is the way. The broad is the way, right? In other words, the broad is talking about the churches. It's talking about the seven day Venice. It's talking about the Roman Catholics. It's talking about um, the Orthodox. It's talking about the universal church. That's what it's talking about. Okay. All right, go ahead, son. It leads to destruction. It what? It leads to destruction. It leads to destruction. Go ahead. And many that be which go in their end, and they're at because straight is the gate. Yeah, straight is the gate. And narrow is the way. And narrow is the way. Which leads to life. And leads to life. And few that be that find it. And there's only going to be a few that find it, man. This right here, what we doing? This is the narrow road, man. Oh, no, you don't want to do that. Four fires. All right? This is straight game, man. And difficulties. But, but, but and only. Yeah, 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 yeah. They will follow that right true. Right true. Right true. But to serve the Lord, every one of them have a problem. Yep. And the feeling, and the thing about it, that the feeling that laughing matter. Um, anybody any church can tell you, yeah, want to do that laugh now? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because the thing is a laughing matter. You know, in the past, they hear me saying this thing, and they think, well, it's a laughing matter. But the scripture says, want to do that laugh now. Go so your moon and weep. Don't, don't turn a trump in power. And as he is in power, you're going to see a lot of prophecies, all these things you see out there that we're talking about. You're going to see a lot of these things coming apart. That was the one, that was the man, Yahweh, God Almighty. That was the man God was waiting to come in power. It was Hillary Clinton. No, he. That was the one who God was talking about. That, 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 you know, Yahweh was in the world. I think it's not a woman. God wanted this nigga. God wanted this nigga. I don't this devil to come in power. A lot of prophecies are going to be fulfilled as he's in power. You're going to see a different America. Want to them not laugh now? Yeah, move! Six! Luke 6 verse 25 Woe to you that are full For you shall hunger Yeah, woe to you full Right now, well, you, you, you people walking around like No Christmas coming We just eat a healthy meal today So we full So these men is madmen at the side of the street, you know Where that? Woe 
Oh, to you that laugh now. Oh, to you that laugh now. You're passing and you're just running around your head and laughing. What is you that over there? Whoa! Oh, to you that laugh now. So want to you that laugh now because martial law. Wait, martial law. Because martial law. Donald Trump is about to bring that martial law. He will be like he's going to increase martial law. And they go and they and, 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 and yeah, gang. And they and they going to bring that same law down in Trinidad. That was the demon that you have machine our child was waiting for. But this to happen. Whoa! Oh, to you that laugh now! So he said, war to you that laugh now, but for ye shall mourn and weep. For ye shall what? Mourn and weep. For ye shall mourn and weep. When Marshall, when they tell it, when they said to kick down your doors. Just so, just so, let's come. One morning you sleep and they kick down your doors and you have no rights. No rights to say nothing. When you were supposed to be right on the street here with these brothers, with the, with the sackcloth on, yeah. and crying out for the people, warning the people, you were supposed to be like a watchman. Yeah, because you was embarrassed to put a garment on. Yeah. Because you're embarrassed because your friend, your, your brother might see you, yeah. or your father, or your mother, or your sister might see you with a garment. Yeah. You're embarrassed to come and serve the Lord, man. Right? Yeah. Look, at, look at what sisters says, we're not the white woman here. The slave, the hell, the hell of the oppressor. So we read that over again, they have one thing that I'm laughing at. Luke 6, 25. One to you that are full, for ye shall hunger. So she's one problem with your white woman here. The Bible says, one to them that are full, they will hunger. Right? Whoa! Unto you that laugh now! One to them that laugh now, she walk with a proud self, but For ye shall mourn and weep! For ye shall mourn and weep! She was, when they were, watch me, as that demon, as that demon in power, she's gonna take out, she weep, she's gonna regret my head. Lord, yeah, how about Jimmy, how about Shai? So you think she don't know the truth? She don't know. Hey, the Bible said, 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 the Bible like we was reading earlier on, yeah. they crucified the Lord afresh. You can, you can get back that same scripture. Read, bring on the preacher. Our preacher, this is First Corinthians two and fourteen. He said, "But the natural man receiveth not the things of the Spirit of God." So, yes, you know, you know what I mean by that. He mean that I'm natural. Cause all these people who walk in, they receive not the things of the Lord. They see that demon who they listening to up the road. That's who they receive. Huh? That's who they receive, and they're proud about it. Go ahead. For they are foolishness unto him. For they are foolishness, but they just think what they're going to be foolishness unto him. Go ahead. Neither can he know them. Neither can he know. He cannot perceive the things that are spiritual. So we tell you, Donald Trump and power and the Lord, and the Lord, the Ahomish in our child, is going to pray in his spirit to wake up the Negroes in America. By how we going to do it? By martial law. By martial law. Go ahead. Because they are spiritually uh, discerned. The things that of the Lord are spiritually certain, a carnal mind can't do that better. Matthew 13, verse 15. For this people heart is wise throats, and their ears are dull of hearing. And their ears, the spiritual ears, not your physical ears, you know, your spiritual ears, your dull ears, they can't hear that word. Because when we put your ear in it, with your physical, but your spirit can receive it. The spirit can receive it. In the eyes, they have clothes. And their eyes, the spiritual eyes, they can hear clothes. The clothes are spiritual eyes, boy. You understand? So you can't see this. Even though you've seen it, you can't really see it. You can't comprehend it. Because the Bible says, want them that are wise in their own eyes, but yeah, perish. Take them off your head. They'll perish. That said the Lord, you all will perish. That when that time reach, you all will perish. Yeah. Yeah? Where that? Lest at any time they should see with their eyes huh. and hear with their ears. He said, less at least at any time. They should see with the spiritual eyes and hear with the spiritual ear. Go ahead. And should understand with their heart. And should understand with your heart. And should be converted and should um, heal them. And you can be converted and be healed. But the, the prophet said the most high crying out on the street. As just say I found with some people. But blessed are your eyes. Bless what they see. For he said, Blessed are our eyes. Because we see and we see we we see what is to come. When the other, these other people are seeing, we seeing what is to come. We know danger ahead. Well, in your ears, for they hear. For the, and our ears, that, our, that they hear our spiritual ear, that we hear this word. Right, right, wait, wait, wait. This is um, Acts 3 and um, 23. Right. He said, and it shall come to pass, 
that every soul which will not hear the prophet and every soul where will I make myself and every soul will not what? hear the prophet uh -huh. shall be destroyed and from it, among the people so mm. every soul so every Israelite that wouldn't hear we God will destroy you from among the people yes. you feel what way everyone always like walking all, all the time taking and everyone all, all these niggas just saying time taking on them and mm. then they go to say no the police was just your time taking on them they have no eye, they have no understanding of this word. But time taken. Yeah, time taken, taken, taken. I got you. Go ahead. Second Chronicles 15, verse 13. That whosoever would not seek the Lord God of Israel. Whosoever will not seek Yahweh Shem Yahweh Shai, the power of Israel. Shall be put to death. Shall be what? Shall be put to death. That is how it's going to happen. Donald Trump going to increase martial law in America. And half of you niggas will surely die just the Lord God of Israel. You should laugh now, but it's serious. Now for the most high, it wasn't Henry to come in power, you know. The most high put him in power. And you're going to put it in his spirit to destroy you niggas. That says the Lord power of Israel. Second Chronicles 15 verse 13. What? That whosoever would not seek the Lord God of so Israel. whosoever will not seek the God of this Bible. Shall be put to death. Shall be what? Put to death! Yeah, martial arts ain't gonna save you. Don Jacob, Don Jetsu, ain't gonna save you. Great. Bro, brother, small or great? Whether you're small or you're great and you don't wanna see the Lord, you watch me as a madman like this man mad, you will be put to death. Brother, man and, or woman? And you know, I was preaching just, just before it's Donald Trump preaching for what I said. 2017, a lot of things gonna happen. Now the Lord elect the right man. All the Hebrew Israelites all over the world was praying for Donald Trump to come in power. And the Lord answer our, our prayer. So now that he's in power, one to you Negroes. Give us Zachariah where um, two thirds of our people will be cut off and die. Amos 5, verse 4. Where? For thus says the Lord unto the house of Israel. Thus says the Lord upon the house of Israel. Seek ye me. Seek ye me, and you shall live. The Lord says, Seek ye me, and you shall live. Ooh. I remember, remember this in the Old Testament? When the Lord command fiery serpents from Moses and it's taking the children of Israel and then he had Moses take up a brazen serpent which was tied from Jesus Christ and he that look upon that serpent shall live so if you don't confirm yourself with God and his Bible hey, and come back to your head and say that's not the Israel that God loves you sinners the Lord said hate sinners the Lord said he hates sinners and will repay vengeance unto the ungodly and, we, and will repay vengeance unto the vengeance is not mine I couldn't tell it just here the Lord vengeance is his Right. And keep them against the mighty day and of keep, their punishment. And keep them against the mighty day of their punishment. All these Negroes are going to die. As Donald Trump in power, every one of them is going to die. Thus says the Lord. Give me Zechariah 13 verse 8. Zechariah 13 verse 8. The Lord never lie. He never lie. He says, as sure as the night come, the day come. And as sure as the day come, the night come. He don't lie. Zechariah 13 verse 8. Yeah. And it shall come to pass. The Lord said, shall come to pass and it will come to pass that in all the land says the Lord and that in all the land says the Lord in Trinidad, Jamaica, America wherever the slave trade was two parts the end shall be cut off and die two parts of you Negroes, Latinos and Native Americans will be cut off and die but the third shall be left the only, end only one third of our people will wake up and realize either Hebrew is your life the Lord bring us here with cargo slave ship and we the Bible but the rest of them will take what the Lord makes you so the Lord said, the, the, the whole thing with that, the Bible yeah. said, the Lord will smite them with madness. Death to the helper. Yeah, of course, the Lord put them so. Yep. The Bible said, I create good and I create evil, says the Lord. Yes, Amos 9 verse 10. Right. All the sinners of my people shall die by the sword. The Lord said, all the sinners of my people shall die by the sword. Donald Trump in power. Yeah. All praises to the Lord. I want to see you Negro's face in a short while. 2017 coming in. Right. Amos 9 10. All the sinners of my people shall die by the sword. So Amos 3 and 10 say, all the sinners of my people. Who is my people? The Negroes upon this land, Trinidad, the uh, Native Indians, and uh, the Latinos, which is the Caribbean Spanish people. What do you want to say about them? All the sinners of my people shall die by the sword. So he said, all the uh, church ain't going to help you. The universal church ain't going to help you. We say the evil shall not overtake nor prevent us. Yeah, we say that we're going to say in the hand, the evil shall not overtake and prevent, but the Lord will bring it upon you. The Lord will bring, get, get the scripture inside from the land of great darkness. Come. Get that scripture, it's serious. Most, Isaiah! 
Isaiah 45. Verse 7. Isaiah 45, verse 7. I form the light. The Lord said, I form the light. And create darkness. And I do not create darkness. Go ahead. I make peace. I make peace. And create evil. And the Lord said, and I create evil. Not Satan. I create evil. I, the Lord, do all these things. I, the Lord, do all these things. God, do that. Thing. Loving Jesus, yes. You know, you never hear that in Christian church. To begin with, Christianity is of the devil. Plain point black. And we can prove that by the word. Right. Proverbs 16, verse 4. Right. The Lord has made all things for himself. The Lord has what? Make all things for himself. Yeah, he created Satan. So why did he, he create good and evil? He created Satan. That's all. Yeah, even the wicked for the day of evil. He said even the wicked for the day of evil. Everybody have a, have a, have a part of playing this, you know? Even the wicked, Donald Trump have a, a part of playing this. Even the wicked for the day of evil. Because my people, when hear my voice, my people walk down the street and watch him and I learn and laugh and feel like a joke and a kiki kiki thing. 20 something coming in. Right? So the Lord says, shall a trumpet blow in? What is the trumpet? The word of God. We cry to all the people. Repent. Repent for the kingdom of heaven is at hand. Right? Let people not be afraid. So shall a trumpet be blown in the city and the people not be afraid? They're afraid. But one thing you all need is you all have pride to come to the Lord. Right? Right? Say, so shall there be evil in the city? Marshall Law is coming to Arima, Port of Spain. Because once Donald Trump in power, he's going to make some legislation. We're going to cope with it. Where? And the Lord had not done it. And the Lord, he said, should there be evil in the city and the Lord has not done it? That's Satan, the Lord. The Lord done it. You know, the thing about Christians, Christians forget that the Lord is a God of vengeance and judgment. You know, all the preachers to you all for years, they see Jesus. But the, God, the Lord is a God of vengeance too. That is the part we don't like to hear in the Bible. That's why we don't really like to read the Bible. That part of Christ we. Right. Isaiah 21 verse 8 right. And he cried, a lion, my Lord, I stand continually upon the watchtower so in the daytime that is, that is we as the Hebrew Israelite men here We stand continually on the watchtower Watching for the coming danger of the people And we people like headless chicken celebrating Christmas Doing all what they said they were doing All what they're doing All the abomination of the earth eating pork Because Christmas coming so I know all the other buy all the pork already And they're directing the law of God Thou shalt not eat the swine because he is unclean to you. Isaiah 62, verse 6. I have set watchmen upon the walls of Jerusalem. The Lord said, I set watchmen on the walls of Jerusalem. The walls of Jerusalem is right here in Arima. Because you people are Jerusalem. You are the children of Israel. You are the Hebrew Israelites of the Bible. So we are the prophets who will come to our reality and realize they know what happened. We are the children of Israel. So God gave us this gospel to come and preach to all of you. So all of that's what you like, wow, boy, wow, 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 wow. Where? I have set watchmen upon the walls of Jerusalem. So he said watchmen upon the walls of Jerusalem. Where? We shall never hold their peace. Which will never, I will never hold my peace. I will continue to reprove all you until all you get vexed with me. Day, no night. Day, no night. Because we worship the Lord day in and day out. We know we don't stop worshiping the Lord. We worship the Lord right to where? Yea, that make mention of the Lord. That keep not their silence. We make mention of the Lord and say, how about shame you I keep not silence. Make vengeance come upon this place. We don't pray for the head of state in United that the money prayer. <laughs> No, 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 that's what Christians pray. Christians pray, Lord, make peace with the head of state. No, we shall bring vengeance on the law and the land. That's right. That's right. Where? Yep. Isaiah 58, verse 1. Where? Cry aloud. What did the Lord say? Cry aloud. So why are we crying? Why are we talking so loud? What did the Lord say to do? Cry aloud. The Lord said, cry aloud. Spare not. Spare nobody feelings. I don't care how you feel about me. Spare no what? Lift up thy voice like a trumpet. Lift up your voice like a trumpet. Right? And show my people their transgression. And show the, my people their transgression. Look, it, it, Israelites walking all over the street and they just don't know. So I just show their transgression. In the house of Jacob their sins. And the house of Jacob their sins. All these Israelites, all these Jacob children. Jacob is their forefathers, not Shaka, Zulu. Jacob. Go ahead. Jeremiah 5 verse 1. Go ahead. Run you to and fro to the streets of Jerusalem. He said, run you to and fro to the streets of Jerusalem, like in Arima here, because the only Israelites we see passing up and down, right? See now and know. And see now and know. And see now and know. That 
seeking a broad place to love. I'm going to the broad place to love, bro. If you can find a man, and I'm trying to see if I can find one man who will stand up and say, Brother, I believe in what I believe the word of God, and I'm willing to come upon a sackcloth and cry the same way for my people. The Lord said, Looking for one man enough, and he had find none up to now. So you can imagine what place we live in, and Sodom and Gomorrah. They're seeking the, they're seeking the truth. He said, Find one man, he said, You find one man who's sick of the truth, and I will pardon it. And I will pardon it. If you see one of all, you wake up, you might pardon it. Yeah, and I want Abraham tell the Lord when he went down, when the Lord was gone, vengeance here on, on Sodom. He said, Lord, if you find 10 righteous, 20 righteous, 5 righteous, 3 righteous, 4 righteous, the Lord said, If I need one, I go, I, 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 I go and punish them. But I know for a fact it have none. Donald Trump in power. I think the Lord going to put it in his spirit to do what he's supposed to do. Yeah, it is what it is. I got it, huh? It said, uh, uh, Second Ezra 7, verse 7. Second Ezra 7, verse 7. The entrance thereof is narrow. The entrance thereof is narrow. And it's set in a dangerous place to fall. And it's set in a dangerous place to fall in America. America is a dangerous place that is going to fall. Well, I was talking about the truth. It's and it's the truth. And it's the truth. It's narrow, but that is, and, and, and it's set in America because America is going to fall. Well, like, as if there were fire on the right hand and like if there were fire on the right hand and on the left a deep water and on the left a deep water a brother coming to the truth and again like a brother coming like the other say like a brother coming to the truth right? and one only path between them both even between the fire and the water and if my lord you know, so small that there could but one man go there at you know, once you know, that up. that's right so it's fire, fire on one side and water on the next and it's a it's a narrow road that's right so when you come to truth it's, it's a narrow road that two men can't go at the same time that's right one going through that road and if a man fall he gonna drown or he gonna go what on fire you understand because right. it said um if the city, if this city now were given unto a man for inheritance, if he never shall pass the danger set before it, how shall he receive this inheritance? You know what I'm saying? How you gonna receive this? It's, it's dangerous. You know what I'm saying? So when you go through this narrow road, there's only one man you go at one time. Because you never see a mango tree. Mango tree, they, they don't write all at one time. They write on a different timing. And what ain't right, that's when we start right. falling. That's right. You understand? Because right now, what we doing, we harvesting right now, man. That's right. That's but right. the harvest is almost right. That's right. That's right. You understand? Know saying? Got brothers waking up in London. Got brothers waking up in Netherland, Jamaica, Guyana. Got brothers all over in America. That's right. Brothers right. wearing the same sackcloth. Right. And we singing the same song. Give me Revelation 14, verse 1. All right? Give me Revelation 14, verse 1, man. That's right. And brothers are ashamed to serve the Lord. You are not the man. You are not a man. You are pussy, man. Brothers, you are recommended to come out here with sackcloth and preach this good tidings, man. That's right. What you got? Revelation chapter 14 was what? Bring it out, huh? And I saw, I'm sorry, and I looked and lo, a lamb stood among Zion and with him 144,000. Come on. Having their father's name written in their forehead. Yeah, the 144,000 represent the 12,000 from each tribe. Right. Judah, Benjamite, Levite, right? Issachar, Zebulon, Naphtali. And it goes all the way down. Yeah. So 12,000 from each tribe. That's right. 12,000 to 12, 12 is what? 144,000. That's right. Go ahead, huh? Uh, yeah, it was two. And I heard a voice from heaven as as a voice of many waters, and as a voice of a great thunder. And I heard the voice of harpers happen with their harps, for street, and they sung a new song. Yeah, ain't talking about, ain't talking about Michelle Montano's song, man. It ain't talking about no cast music. It ain't talking about no, no, no name, no stanky, uh, the stanky land. It ain't talking about that. It ain't talking about no Little Wayne or no Jay-Z. The same song that we singing is the same song all brothers around the world are singing, which is the truth. That's right, right. Which is the truth. The same breaks down. 
That's right. That's the yeah. same song it's talking about, man. That's we right. singing in one accord in the same doctrine. That's right. Preach yeah. our doctrine. Right. Not no bullshit doctrine. We're talking about Mary only got pregnant by the Holy Spirit. It ain't Joseph was not involved. Get the hell out of here, man. That's right. What? That go back right. to that Roman.